first time. Okay, tell me about the first time someone asked you for your autograph. Uh, first time I think I was high school. Uh, I was a freshman. Uh, I think I was getting, you know, people asked me for autographs just because of Jamal Crawford. Because I mean, they went to the same high school. And so he was like, you know, the man on the team. So I would just sign the autograph because, you know, everybody wanted his. And I was just on the team. And uh, I remember signing my first autograph. It was just like, wow. You know, I kept myself at home practicing. I had so many different ones as a kid. And then, you know, now look at it. Like now, it's like crazy. Like, it's just weird. How is it, how is it evolved in... Do you find that you give a different autograph depending on, you know, if you're out in public or... Not sign the same way. Every single way. It depends on what number I wear, though. If my number changes, I have a different, you know, a number and how I sign it. But uh, pretty much I've been four, you know, most of my whole career, so my four has been the same for the longest. Sure. I know that you do some private signings uh, in the Boston area since you joined the Celtics. Are there any limitations to, you know, what you can sign elsewhere? Or is that just for that particular event? Nah, I mean, I mean, I'm not... I'm not uh, I'm not against not signing. It's just uh, you know whoever wants to book me for autographs, I guess I don't know. Uh, you know Boston, Boston for the most part, you know they're like you know, it's a it's a rich tradition of, uh, of basketball Celtic pride there, and you know they love their Celtics. So uh, I, mean, I have a lot of bookings in Boston just because you know so many people they love memorabilia. So it's just it's just pretty cool you know to be in Boston and you know be able to sign and be a part of the, the tradition there. Yeah. So you you mentioned before about. You know, your feelings about seeing your autograph kind of sold on a secondary market, has that affected? No, nah, I mean, like I said, like, you know, you know, you know everybody's different. You know, people, you know, you know, whatever their job to do to, you know, to, to make ends meet, I don't, you know, I don't, I don't, uh, I'm not against it. You know, okay. so I, I, mean, I, I try to sign as many autographs as I can, but most I try to aim for the kids more, you know what I'm saying, because it, for them, I'm like really, you know, reaching out to them and touching them. You know, it's not, you know, for them to make money. It's like they really, they really care. They really want my autograph. It's kind of, you know, I, I I felt the same way when I when I asked Steve Francis for his autograph. He's one of my favorite players, and he, and he took a picture with me. And I thought a picture, you know, that was way more than an autograph back then. And I was like, I was excited, and I was ecstatic, and I never forgot. You know, I, I'll never forget it. I never forgot it. And I, I had a picture when I got to the NBA, and I showed him that he took with me. And I was like 15, and he was just like, wow, like you know, what I'm saying how time flies. Are there any other players uh, that you've asked whether you know when you were uh, smaller or in the league? Is there any uh, autographs or other memorabilia that you? Could collect from your playing uh, days? From my playing days, uh, I mean, I, I just took, like I said, I got pictures with a couple guys, Magic Johnson, uh, Damon Stoudemire, Quinn Richardson, a lot of guys when I was growing up. But, uh, you know, now, I mean, when I was in the league, I collected a lot of guys, Allen Iverson, uh, I got jerseys from LeBron, shoes from, you know, Carmelo, uh, who else, Tony Parker, so many guys. Like, I try to collect as much as I can for my kids so I can put that away, you know, put that away for them so they can, uh, you know, so they can, you know, benefit from it and see, you know, you know, what dad was trying to do for them, you know, so they can, you know, realize, you know, how special they had it. Thank you so much. You really appreciate it. That